Today we're going to talk about Lucifer and the Biscuit Hammer, episode 16. <laughs> they see the episode already. And I'll explain why, so keep watching. It's quite the, um, it's quite the eye-opening episode that it is. But, uh, we'll, we'll get to that, okay? First order of business, guys, is the thumbnail. It's probably the most ominous sign in this entire anime. The Biscuit Hammer. It's a grim and constant reminder to the beast knights that they got a job to do. They need to stop animals from, from letting that planet-sized thing fall on the planet. Except for one, Chitayu. Right? So, with that in mind, we are now going to the nitty-gritty of the episode. Face! This episode's got the, got the slice of light elements, but overall, the pacing will tell you that in full detail, okay, in full detail, how um, how much of an ally to animals the owl knight is. Okay, nagkaroon ng fight scene dito, dalawang beses, at dalawang fight scene, pero because the pacing, my attention wasn't on, wasn't on, uh, wasn't on the two fight scenes. It was on Tayo the whole time. It had a slow, but but almost excruciating kind of pacing. If it weren't for um, uh, the slice of life elements were in um, Amamiya, si Yuhi, and the other beast knights are still treating him as a as an ally, which is disheartening. Every time. Uh, well, the pacing will make you feel this way. Every time uh, the other beast knights would treat him well, he would uh, he would secretly um, he would secretly drop them for animals. Why have complaints? No. Nope. The pacing was just right for this kind of a, kind of an episode storyline. Flora, now let me pre-frame this one a bit. These two gear sheets are quite confirmatory in nature. So, let's get down to it. First one was when Tayo voluntarily switched places with the Macterion, the 11 eye Golem. Yeah, that, that Golem were in, the Golem that has the ability to disguise itself really effectively. Well, no brain of a gear shift there. Kasi, kakampi siya ni Animus eh. So, lahat ng Alagang na golem ni Animus Pwede niyang Well, actually quite It's practically at his disposal Final gear shift Was when Mimacterion uh, Picked up Tayo From, from his uh, house party With the other beast knights As Tayo's father That's a no-brainer of a gear shift also Bakit? Kasi Well It just goes to show you how valuable an ally uh, Tayo is to animals. So these two gears that I saw, guys, these two confirms uh, Tayo's value to animals as an ally. Panoorin nyo ang dalawang gears na to, magigets nyo na buong episode. But, I strongly suggest to watch the whole episode pa rin. This backstory involved uh, Yukimachi and Subaru. Kung paano sila naging beast knight. Right, but it's quite negligible. negligible. But uh, the episode is planned after them. So, plan chat on plan, guys. Although I view this episode as uh, as uh, Tayo's episode, look, it's still. Uh, what's called this? It's still the episode where the focal point, the focal points are Yukimachi and Subaru. Kasi silang, silang nakapanganan sa title. That backstory sequence is almost negligible. If it weren't for uh, the title of the episode, I might have, uh, I might have deemed this episode's plot clean. Alright? So, right now, planchado ang, ang plot ng episode na to. Because, uh, 
uh, mainly because of that backstory sequence which is about uh, Yukimachi in Subaru but nonetheless the entire episode is about yeah, Tayo's treachery okay so based flow and plot yeah, you all came together for this episode folks this episode confirms and expounds if not expounds uh, Tayo's al secret alliance with animals so Lucifer and the Biscuit Hammer episode 16 mm. I'm gonna explain why now Okay, this will be this will also be my parking shot for this uh, for this review. Well, <clears throat> it had those slice of life feels, pero I think it could have done more. Uh, where Tayo would have a conscience check, it would. Uh, I wish they would uh, have scenes here where Tayo would would. Uh, would have second thoughts about siding with animals kasi uh, maganda naman ang trato sa kanya ng mga huwing bong beast fights eh I don't know pero ito lang yung ano eh parang ito yung for me ito yung pinakakulang ng episode na to but don't be uh, uh, what's called this don't get me wrong, guys. It still got the one thumb up for me. Alright? It this episode still confirms uh and if not expounds on on his uh on his association with animals. Which is a vital part of yeah, so far the entire of this entire story of this entire anime storyline. This he is uh the moon. And he is the complication in the storyline. So, justify naman yung one eh. Yung, yung storyline ng buong episode na But, they could have done more. They could have done more. So again, Lucifer the Biscuit Hammer, episode 16. His secret might get exposed already. We'll see in the next episode, in the next few episodes. 